Ah, hello, good evening, me hearties. It's just me, Scotty McClue, and it's six minutes past eight on Sunday night, Sunday the 19th of February. Lovely to have you with us. And thank you do. Matthew's just joined us and Neil is joining. Welcome, welcome, I see. I thought we'd do a quick pop-up because last night we had one or two problems with the calls on the YouTube channel and it would be nice to see if we'd managed to fix that. Hello, Scotty. Hope you're well. Hello, Kian. How lovely to hear from you. How it is, says Studio. Hi, how are you doing? Thank you, do, Matthew. And good evening, Captain from Norwich. Neil, how lovely to have you with us. How is Norwich tonight? Is it very, very windy? Sorry about all the jumping there. Cameraman staggered. And uh, thank you, do, Scotty. Hello, came back. Lovely to have you. Welcome, welcome, I say. And we are also live on the YouTube channel, Dinky Doo, the world's best kept secret. So if you get to the YouTube channel, don't tell anyone. All right, we keep it secret. Good evening from Liverpool. Hello, Scouse. Dinky Doo. No, it's cold. It's cold, says, uh, says Neil. It will be. Norwich is usually quite a cool city. Oh, see what I just did there. Follow us as soon as you can. Thanks, K Mac. Very much appreciated. Everybody should be following Scotty McClue because it's the right thing to do. That's what I say. Now then, uh, I just wondered who was about, so I thought we'd say hi, see who was around, and have a little bit of a chit chat tonight. Valerie's just joined us, and Kim's joined us. Tremendous. It's a fine city. Norwich is a fine city, I can tell you. So there are, do you know who Barry is? Yes, Harley. I spoke to Barry last night. There we have it. You see, hello, Scotty. Hello, Tom. Good that you could make it. Well done for joining us, I say. Get following, everybody. Everybody on TikTok should actually be following Scotty McClure. We never slow, we never troll. 12 noon here. Ah, studio strips. Dinky do. Hi from Scotland. Hello, who that girl? Good evening, Scotty. And dinky do, big Lloyd. Uh, who that girl says hi. Uh, evening, Scotty from Rutherglen. And always good to have you on from Rutherglen. Did you see my wee bit I did about Cambus Lang? It's live in the videos. Cumnock. We love Cumnock, Nicole. A fine part of the world with a tremendous history. Good evening, Floatai. Donnie, good evening, hashtag Floatai, first lord of the internet. Love you, Scotty, from Coat Bridge. We love Coat Bridge, I said you. Just arrived, sounds like you're doing what's meant from Ayrshire. Hi from Ayrshire, Donna. Dinky do. Uh, no, of course he does, he's a Scotsman. What's this we're talking about? Yes, I did brilliant. Excellent, and I'm glad you enjoyed our wee chat about the Canvas Lang, the Halfway, the West Bun, the Whitler Bun, all that kind of stuff. Stilling here. Hello, Stilling. I started your radio station 33 years ago. Independence, Scotty. Ah, yes. Scotty, what's all this nonsense with trans? Well, I would have thought there was a big stushy last week about what is a woman. And somebody saying a woman is an adult female. Up the Royal Artillery, Scotty, says Paddy. Good one, Paddy. We salute the Royal Artillery, a very fine regiment of the British Army. You and I are singing from the same hymn sheet. Sounds like a horse race tonight. Ah, oh, there you are. There they are coming into the final far long now. And it's the butcher on the outside. Happy, happy in the inside there. Uh, loved Scott FM. Oh, everybody loved Scott FM. The only people that damaged Scott FM were the managers at the time. Good evening, Scott. It's Ali from Drum the Drocket. I love Drum and the Drocket. I have friends in Drum the Drocket, and I must come and see them. They're always saying to me, do come and see us. And I didn't realize how long ago it was they invited me. And uh, they said, the wee ones would love to see you as well. And I said, how are the wee ones? They said, the wee ones are at university, Scotty. <laughs> Watching from Lark Hall, sir. Ah, tremendous. And Robin, yes, Robin Galloway, customer service, a very fine broadcaster. Are you living in Scotland? I am. I'm back in Scotland, Donna. Have you ever been to Malig? Well, do you know? I haven't. That's a luxury. I've denied myself, and I would love to take the train to Malay because we'd go over the Glenfinnan viaduct. 
Uh, you know, say hi to me, Billy Joe. I'm a big fan. Athena, of course I will. Dinky Doo, John Diamond has just joined us. Is everybody following, guys? Everybody on TikTok. Step one, you follow Scotty McClue. It's the way it should be. There we are. So please get following as soon as you possibly can. There we have it. Everybody should be following. Uh, follow us. Thank you very much, Donna. That's so good of you. Donna has followed what a thoroughly decent human thing to do, I say. Uh, hi, Scotty. Hi, Joe. Are you all right? John, sorry. It's John. John Diamond. Dinky do. You are a diamond, I say. Uh, good evening, all. Dinky do. And welcome if you've just joined us to the YouTube channel. Tremendous to have you with us. We shave tonight. Face a little bit red, but getting better. Lol, lol, Donna. Thank you, dear. Hiya, Scotty. Oh, fantastic stuff. Now then, who's not followed? Let's see. Oh. Can everybody give an O oh to the non-followers? Oh. Come on, get following as soon as you can. Very, very important. Good evening, Sir Scotty. Hello, Alistair. And lovely to have you with us. And a big dinky do. What a top man. Follow us as soon as you can, guys. We're very tight uh, for time tonight. And I want to get as many of you on here as possible so we can chit chat. I'm also going to open the phone lines and take a few calls. So maybe somebody will give me a little test call. Follow us as soon as you can. Thank you, Stephen. What a top man. Stephen Mary. Wonderful. Hello, Scotty. Hello to you, Stephen. And thanks for joining us on TikTok's Talk Talk Show. Ah, yes. You try saying that with a light refreshment in you. Sounds like a horse race tonight. Think I'd be quite good at the commentary for the racing. Uh, so what's the end game with you? Well, Matthew, I think the end game is that we get a million followers on TikTok and a million subscribers on YouTube, and then we cut back on our workload, and we just have little chats with the globe from time to time. Uh, I think that's the end game. Glad to see you're still on the ball, oh, Stephen. We're on the ball. We've never been off the ball. I wouldn't mind going on to off the ball, a very fine program on uh, Radio Scotland on a Saturday afternoon. I've had a mention on there, you know. You still look the same from 30 years ago. I know. I looked pretty old then, didn't I? <laughs> Sounds good to me. I am with you. Absolutely, Matthew. So as soon as we hit the million, then we cut back on the workload and we have wee chats with the globe. Uh, Favourite football team, Dan? Come on then. I've got so many. We love the Man United. They might be getting bought, you know. Do you think I should buy them? They used to be right just behind me when I worked in Salford at Media City. Let's do it together, says Matthew. Absolutely, Matthew. Yes, so a bit of a hand would be good to fetch one million followers on TikTok and one million subscribers on YouTube. Has everybody subscribed to the YouTube? There's Scaramanga. How are you doing, Scotty, or Scaramanga? It's lovely to hear from you. A Brexit geezer, well, a sort of anti-Brexit geezer, Big Becky. Because Brexit, I, I actually predicted this um, seven years ago. I said, if you exit the EU, it will lead to economic annihilation and political fragmentation. Was I right or was I just 100% correct? Uh, so there we are, thank you, dear. Scott FM was amazing. Does anyone still call you? Uh, no, 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 no. Well, we get lots of yes. We get people on the phone in from Scott FM. I had one last night. Big Rab uh, is from uh, the Scott FM days. Do you know anything about golden bullets, Scotty? Uh, well, I don't think I fancy one, Scaramanga, you know. Uh, let's just put it that way. It's been a while. It's been far too long, Scaramanga. Don't you leave it so long next time. The man with the golden gun. Was that right? That's Scaramanga. Was that the same one? Oh, no, it was Goldfinger, wasn't it? The odd job was in. 
he with the, 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 the dangerous hat, the risky, dodgy headgear. Uh, Scotty McClure, dinky do, monkey man, how lovely to have you with us. This is just fantastic. We love it. Guys, I need another 20 followers. And hurry up. Hurry up. I don't want you going, oh, no, no, we're not. If you're going to be like that. No, no. have any of that. We hurry up and get following. Uh, hi, Scotty. Hope you're well. Negan, thank you. Oh, Negan. I to apologize to you for saying, was it not uploaded? Because we couldn't hear the calls on the YouTube last night, I hadn't realized. Uh, but I've uploaded the TikTok onto the YouTube, and you should still get that. Scotty, are you doing Collins? We are. Would you like to ring? I'll open the phones up, guys, and we can have a chat on the phone. So I want to see if you can hear it on the YouTube. Right. I've opened up the phones, so if anybody wants to give us a call, 0141, all right, have you got that? 0141 628 There you are. What's your main topics? Well, our main topics tonight, one is one that we're having a debate on video, and it is if you are Scottish, you are definitely... 100% British, because you live in Great Britain, which is a landmass. There's no such country as Britain. The monarchy has adopted the term British for the monarchy. But when you hear people, even prime ministers going, I love this country, which country are they talking about? Scotland, England, Northern Ireland, or Wales? So there we are. Dink you do. Aria. I thank you. I was in Loch Lomond this weekend. A stunning place. It is. It is trucker lad. Uh, so there we got here. Uh, can't vote for hard borders between Scotland and England, but still love you. Matthew, there wouldn't be a hard border. You know, we'd have a proper understanding. Scotland just needs to be able to hang on to its income. Scotland's only gets about 37% of what it makes. The rest goes to Westminster. Call, guys. You're live with Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Oh, Scotty, this is Alex. Alex, how are we? Oh, bye. Oh, he's away. There we are. Could you hear Alex on the YouTube, guys? I need to know. Alex panicked a wee bit. He was doing okay. And then he just, his bottle went. And it never, ever should, guys. Uh, we had a couple of wee halfwits phoning up and shouting down the phone. But uh, there we go. Aria dinky do. Uh, share the live, guys, and get following. England is what they mean, as everything is about England. Yes, I think people need to be careful. When they talk about the royal family, they talk about the king of England, and when her late majesty Queen Elizabeth II was on the throne, they talked about the Queen of England. Now, technically, they are the Queen and the King of England. Well, not technically, they are. But they're also the Queen and the King and Head of State of Scotland and Northern Ireland and Wales. So, you see, we need that. Thank you so much, Aria. There we go. Guys, give us a call. 0141 628 And uh, we can get the chat going. Uh, lots and lots of you watching right now. Uh, now, who have we got here? Uh, you would be part of the EU. Well, yes, the only thing, Matthew, I'm a little bit sus of the leadership of the EU at the moment. It used to be a lot better, uh, but a little bit sus of the unelectable side. Oh, sorry, I beg your pardon, not unelectable, unelected. There we are. Let's see who this is. You're live with Scottish funny. Who's that? Are you still here doing me? Who's that? It's Big Jim. Big Jim. How lovely to hear you. Guys, can we hear Big Jim on the YouTube channel, please? Speak up, Jim, and tell us how you are. Oh, fantastic. Thanks for asking, Scotty. Uh, how are you getting on? Oh, How's things? Listen, you know, I'm, I'm better for hearing you. Oh, we've lost Jim. Now, I didn't touch anything, I promise you. I wonder why that is. 
Um, yes, I saw, I loved Scotty. I was watching it with the calls. And we could hear him, but it was quiet. I think you need to turn him up a bit. Big Jim is quiet. Negan, it doesn't matter. We'll turn him up. This is great news because we couldn't hear last night and I hoped I'd sorted it, but who knows? So it's so good that we can hear him. Uh, yes, I am the man with the golden gun with my compadre, Nick Knack. Nick Knack. And when there are not a couple of very attractive ladies, Scaramanga, I say to you, I know, Scotty, I've missed you. There we are, fantastic. Uh, we could hear him, yes, yes, bit quiet, bit quiet. Right, so maybe Jim will phone us back for another wee chat, and we'll see if we can get him on here. Uh, dinky do every day, what do we got here? It's my clue. What a life. So there we are. So there we are. Harry, I had to go somewhere else. There, so let's not go into all that. Always stronger together. Well, no, Matthew. Stronger together from the point of view of England and Wales. Not stronger together from the point of view of Scotland. If you were used to having 100% of your income, and I only gave you 37% and went off with the other 63%. Uh, you think we were stronger? Uh, I'm too loud there, man. Right of my life. Right. Hello, you're live on Scottish phone in. Who's that? It's Big Jim. Big Jim. I don't know what happened, Jim, if, whether it was you or me. I think you're locking me, Scotty. We lost you. I think you're hung up in me. No, no, I would never do that. Why would I hang up on you, Jim? Because you do know what I think. Not at all, only, only it's a bad, if... It's a, bad, it's a bit of a bad habit you've got. A bad habit uh, hanging up on Big Jim. <laughs> well, we, we, need to, like, we need to rid I'm ourselves of that. I'm dead you do, Jim. It's lovely to hear you. It's, uh, it's good to hear you on my phone and not over the, the wireless. Over the, the, back in the day, you know? Jim, tell me this. How are the phones doing? Does it sound quite good? Is it quite a good setup? I don't know. Let me ask the guys if they can hear me. Well, that's what I'm going to do. Let me just check. Guys, can you let me know? Uh, keep chatting, Jim. Tell me how you are. Can you I'm let good, me know if we can hear Big Jim? We can't hear Jim Scotty. Scotty, now uh, we can't hear the calls. Maybe some of your setup or what, maybe. Uh, yeah, but I don't understand because they said we couldn't hear you. Do you have a feed that comes from your phone and your uh, recording stuff for YouTube? No, well, I'll tell you what I did do. I put in the speakers, and it yeah, might be yeah, something yeah. to do with the speakers, Jim. That's what be then. There's something different from... Let me try it with the speakers. Let me take that out. Test it out while I'm on the phone. See if we can get it sorted. See if we can get it sorted, Jim. I wonder if we can hear you now. Aye, just see what the guy said. Just ask them. Guys, can you, can you hear Big Jim now? We need to know. That's what it's all about. Yeah. Yeah. Can so we, did, you, did, did you manage to pull the speakers out? Well, I've pulled the speakers out, but I don't know if that's actually helped any. Interesting stuff, you know. So, but it yeah. says you're giving it out a hundred percent. I, I'm speaking normal. So, what are the guys saying? Can you hear me? Can you guys hear me? Yes, maybe there's a limiter on the F document says to stop it peaking. What was that? Sorry. F document. Hang on, hang on. We're in business here. Stay there, Jim. Don't go anywhere. Yeah, I'm going anywhere. Don't go anywhere, Jim. Are you going uh, microphone headset, recording an audio output. There we are. Let's just see. Just don't go anywhere, Jim. Uh, this would be tremendous. It's so good of you. Um, That's fine. Troubleshooting is my middle name. You're <laughs> some man for the troubleshooting, I'll tell you. That is just great. Oh, uh, we don't oh. want that. that was, oh. There we are. Fantastic stuff. I don't know where that's come from. It says, your lives flagged for hateful behaviour. When have we ever done any hateful behaviour? Hmm. Not at all. I don't understand that. Than, I'll tell you something, Scotty. Your, your show's much cleaner than it was back 20 years ago. I'll tell oh, you that. Oh, Jim, it was wild. 
<laughs> it was absolutely wild, but it was arguing was, about the single mums having the heave hole and the, the fatty somebody to pay double fares on the bus because he picked up a full seat. <laughs> that's right, that's right. But it was but it was so popular. I mean, we were quarter of a million people every half hour. Uh, you know, I was one of those guys. Very, very strange, Jim. And are you keeping all right, eh? I am good, I just busy the walk, you know. We shall we <laughs> shall get this audio sorted. Because it was okay. working before. Yeah. And we'll, we'll find out what's what. <laughs> right. Jim, Good lovely to hear you. And dinky you do, sir. Yeah, I'll, I'll head off, mate. And uh, you have a good night, Scott. Yeah, and right? and you, thanks sorry. so much for coming on. You're a top man. Ah, you're welcome. So you'll speak to you soon, mate. Cheers, Jim. All the best. Good. Isn't that great? Dinky you do. That was big, Jim. Could we hear him, uh, Setio? Uh, because I wonder, I wonder if it's too loud. It's clipping your sound, Scott. It sounds like it's cutting the high sounds. Turn Jim right low and see if it comes out. A right F document. That's what we will do. But we need to get back to it because it was working great for a long, long time. And uh, we wanted to continue working great. Guys, we're going to get another 10 minutes, uh, Sergio. So let's use it well and wisely. Uh, now, Aaron, I think we don't need half wits like you on with your tiny IQ of one. So what we'll do is we'll uh, we'll just dump you. There we are. Fantastic. Wonderful stuff. That's him gone. Uh, we don't want uh, any silly people on here. It's 2023. We didn't vote for a monarchy of the leaders. Yes, we did. Mickey G. Of course, we voted for a monarchy. We voted for the monarchy in uh, April of 1320. It's called the Declaration of Our Broth. And that's when we chose our monarch and the present uh, lot, our heirs and successors. So there we are. So it doesn't matter what the date is, we will always need a monarchy because our symbol of authority is the crown and the monarch is the custodian and curator of the crown. Capiche? Everybody happy with that? There we are. Uh, so what have we got here? There's another one away. Absolutely. Isn't that fantastic? A couple of half-wits just on the um, disrespectful half -wits. Thank you, Scotty, for keeping the nation's finger on the pulse. There we are. F document. Sturgeon is gone. What do you think? I'm very sorry that she's gone because she was very good for Scotland. But uh, we'll see what's happened. Yes. Uh, see what... Uh, what uh, appears. I'm sure our oil and wind farms uh, and Aaron cheese would do okay. Yes, Donna, you've got to realize that uh, you might just have one or two people in Scotland turning out huge money. Uh, on the uh, TikTok, everybody can hear the callers loud and clear. So it's something to do with the YouTube channel. Uh, when you get less than 50% of your own cash to spend, then we'll be fine if we get it all. Absolutely, Mickey. There's uh, Christoire. Christoire, bonsoir. Bonsoir, Christoire. Ça va? Oui, ça va très bien, moi aussi. Uh, Stephen Mulgrew, dinky -doo. Lovely to have you with us. Uh, now, what have we got here? Um, Lesko Brandon. Yes. He's one of the low lies, I think, uh, uh, coming out with that sort of stuff. So we'll get rid of that. That's it. He's away. Fantastic. Now, Mark, uh, think you do. Scotty, love from Bonnie, Bonnie Lanarkshire. Mark, how lovely to have you with us. And think you do. I say, what do you use for your phone calls, Scotty? Uh, well, we use the old SKYPE. I've got to be careful about saying proprietary names on here. Sometimes it chops off. Scotty, it's a biker from Drumna Drockett. <laughs> life's too short let's stick together yeah that's okay for England but life's too short to stick together if we're losing 63% uh, 60, of our income do you see what I mean uh, we will on the same land yes we're on the same land it's a land mass Matthew news flash the phone's going Scotty I know we got it uh, same so much echo sounds terrible we a bit loud Big Jim coming through loud and clear, says Chris. Wow. There we are. That's better, says Matthew. Uh, we can hear you, Big Jim. 
Fantastic. Lovely. We like that. Thank you. Who's followed and who's not? There we are. Who are following and who are not? Let me be your ICT technician, Scotty. Oh, clear soir. I bet you would be outstanding. Thank you, just having a wee sip of tea. There we go. Fantastic stuff. Now then, um, what have we got here? Lots and lots of lovely people coming on. Fantastic stuff. Guys, if you're watching on the YouTube, uh, can you get subscribing? Let's see who this is. You're live in Scottish phone in. Who's that? Oh, Scotty, is it true that you're filming for the... You're live in Scottish phone in. Who's that? Oh, Scotty, my name is Martin. Hello. Martin, how lovely to hear you now. Martin, just give me half a second. YouTubers, can you hear Martin? That's what we need to know. Kareem's just joined us. Thank you, Kareem. Lovely to have you with us. Let us know if we can hear Martin. Chat away to me, Martin. How are you, I'm Scotty, buddy? Are you, are well, you okay, mate? I'm yeah. better for hearing you. It's lovely to hear you. How's your channel yeah. going? My channel's doing really, really well. Um, Kareem's been in and in, Kareem's been in, in, in and out watching me. Um, right. He said he said he's doing very, very well. Excellent. Um, so um, take the high road. I'm, but I'm beginning, to, I'm beginning to go off now because there's not much happening in that stage yet. Ah, right. Um, but you must be getting... I'm moving, I'm well on. I'm going back to London's anyway in April. So, uh -huh. uh, you must be getting very well on, though, are you not? I am. Um, I've got... I have been on it for almost a year now in the station. So, um... So... That's excellent. Uh, guys, can we all hear Martin? Give us your chat, Martin, so we can hear you. Um, don't want to see you very much. What do you think of... Um, Nicholas Sturgeon leaving um, the signing, which you have Well, Martin, it was a bit of a shock, wasn't it? It was a bit of a surprise. Yes, 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 yes it was. You know? Um, mm -hmm. Any idea of who's going to be the next one? Well, that's it. We just don't know, and we don't like to speculate, you know? Mm -hmm. I know, I know, I know. So how's them? How's them, Susan getting on, Susan? Um, she's she's she's, she's not better. been very well, but I think she's a bit better. Is she? Yes, yes, excellent stuff. Good evening, Scotty. Is Emma. Good, good evening, Emma. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Fantastic. We unfortunately are having trouble <laughs> hearing you. Are you hurt? Yes. YouTube. Yes, the YouTubers are having trouble hearing. We've had trouble for the last day or two. Uh -huh. and, uh -huh. and we don't know what it is. It must be, have you, Scottish, have you tried putting your volume up in your, um, in your Skype? You, you try putting your volume up. Ah, well, there's an interesting one. I'll maybe have a wee look at that, Martin. So maybe, so maybe look at the volume and ask and try and phone you back again later if you're still on. So wait a minute. So don't don't rush off. See if you can help me. Don't just stay. Martin, stay for a wee second for me just as a favour for an old pal. That would be great. And I can see if we can uh, if we can do something about it. Okay, That would be excellent. Guys, can we... Um, Oh, that's working all right, yeah. Uh, see if we can hear Martin. I don't understand why we can't. That's what I'm finding really difficult. Hello, Kareem. Hello, yes, Kareem's there. Yes, it says the audio is 100%. Okay. So that, that's what it's telling me. It's saying audio... 100%. That's, yes. That is very, very strange. So, uh, no. input, yes. Um, mm -hmm. So, there we go. Can anybody hear that now? Is that any better? Have a wee chat now, Martin. 
Mm. Are you able to come and see my channel anyway? Uh, yes, we need to come and see your channel. I think it will be amazing. There we are. Anything? So that's that. We can on TikTok, but not on YouTube. Guys, what we're getting now, if you're watching on YouTube, can you hear me and, uh, and all that sort of thing? We're just seeing if we can still get them, Martin. There we are. I think... Are you, are you still with Scotty? Yes, I am. Uh, I'm just going to go on to that. There we are. Can you hear me now, Martin? Yes, yes. Can you uh, hear me? Yes, I can hear you. But I don't know if the callers... We can hear you, Scotty, but not Martin. So that's a bit of a shame. <laughs> Noise yeah. cancellation, click it off. Where's that F document? Where would we find that? <laughs> yeah. Everything's very good. There's Ben Salterboy. Is enjoying the Scotty McClue specs. They've been around a long time, haven't they? Bye. <laughs> Martin, lovely to hear you. Thank you for all your help. And good luck with the channel. Martin. Yes, can you hear me? Hello, can you hear me? Can you hear me, Martin? Hello? Can you hear me, Martin? Hello, Martin? Are you Scotty? Yes, can you hear me? <laughs> ah, there we are, obviously not. Right, can everybody else hear me now? Do tell, I say to you, uh, we need to do a little bit of technical work. Tremendous stuff. <laughs> Hello, you're live in Scottish morning. Who's that? Hello, it's Scottish. Thank Jim again. Jim, can you hear me just now? Can you hear me okay, yeah? Yeah, can you hear me? Hello? Hello, can you hear me, Jim? Hello, can you hear me? Hello, hello? Hello, hello, can you hear me, Jim? Hello? Hello, hello? can you hear me, Jim? <coughs> Hello? Can you hear me? Uh, hello? Can you hear me, Jim? Hello? Uh, I wonder what's going on there. Hello? Hello? Right. Uh, how's everybody doing? Can you hear me, folks? Dinky do, tell us if you can hear us. Nothing, says Matthew. Scotty. Uh, so there we go. Let's just see what's happening here, guys. Um, surprised he hasn't asked for any gifts or donations. Well, you know that I never, ever, ever, ever do. Unless anybody's feeling flush. Hello, you're live with Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hello? Hello? Hello, can you hear me? <coughs> no, there we are, obviously not. Right, uh, we seem to be having a wee problem now, so I'll have to have another look, guys. Bear with me. Let's see what is what. Right. <coughs> Hello, you're live with Scotty Hi. Spooning. Can you hear me? Hi, Scotty. Can you hear me? I can hear you, Scotty. That's tremendous. Is that Kareem? Yes, hi, Scotty. Wonderful, Kareem. Thank you. I'm very glad we're here. That was a funny wee experiment there. But of course, as you know, once you start mucking about, Kareem, can you believe this guy, 180 horses? He goes, surprised he hasn't asked for any gifts or donations. And oh. I mean, I never, ever do. People very no. kindly give me, including your dear self. But, uh, uh, you know, I, I, I never ask. I was just jealous that nobody gives him any gifts. It might be, that's that. what it might be, Kareem. A wee touch of the green-eyed monster. You sometimes <laughs> wonder why if somebody can't agree with you, they have to be unpleasant. 
correct and um, I think that's the society we live in nowadays where you have to think their way or to go on the highway that, that's right their way or the highway I remember somebody saying to me once quite an overbearing chap and he said it's my way or the highway and I said well I think it's the highway. <laughs> <laughs> okay, excellent. Right, all well, sound gone now, Scotty, says F document. There we are. Scotty, your audio has vanished. Just trying to troubleshoot the issue. Noise cancellation on Skype. I thought it was on the clipping the collar. I can't hear yeah. anything, says VJ. So there we have that it. Would, that would explain last night's call, Scotty, when people couldn't hear me and it was just a YouTube, so... Yes, um, yes, it was just a YouTube. So everything else is working fine, but it's something mm -hmm. to do with connecting the YouTube output with the yeah. Skype. You know, it's normally the simplest thing, I think. You'll, you'll, you'll figure it out. Oh, it'll so be a wee... Out. Listen, Karim, it'll be a wee click somewhere. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and I'm sure that your speech and folk will obviously let you know once they can... There we are. Oh. Can you hear me now? I'm going to put, and that's that, and we'll see what comes up. They're still saying no audio. Right. Right? Yeah, okay. And they can't yep. hear me for some reason. Right. Right? No. So F document, can you hear me? No audio, Scotty. You paid the bill. Of course we have more than Stallion. Right. Uh, no, says Negan. So I'm saying, can you hear me and Negan saying no? So he obviously can. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> it's quite funny, isn't it? Do you think so? I heard it? you saying on uh, YouTube, it was just the callers. Uh, it was just the call. Yeah, absolutely. Now, Kareem, excellent call last night. I've put a bit of it up. Because uh, right. people, people need to hear you, you see. And uh, I've been admiring your stuff on TikTok as well. Thank you, thank you. You know, that's, yeah. ra that's rather good. Yes. Uh, I think it's important that politics at the moment is, is changing in the UK, and I think it's changing for the worse. You know, we don't have EU rules and regulations to protect us, and the, the majority of that will finish, or a lot of it will, on January 2024, less than a year. So, you know, people's right to strike is going out the window. People's right to protest. Uh -huh. You know, two basic things are human rights and dignity. And something I'm quite worried about as well, Scotty, is the, it, it, it's more down south, but they're trying to sucker people up here in Scotland. Uh -huh. Labour are no different from the Tories. Tony Blair and Gordon Brown moved old Labour away from their traditions and principles. And if you think they were bad, wait till you see Keir Starmer when he gets into power. Uh, it's just going to be like Tory government all over again, but just a different colour badge. That is that. Well, that's rather disappointing, but that's kind of the way that the money men like it. You see, as we said yeah. to you before, this country has no money of its own. The money mm -hmm. is in the city of London. The city of London is like a separate state. I mean, I heard a very interesting thing today, somebody saying that um, in, uh, in real terms, the United States has never left Britain, and Britain still uh, is the mama for the United States. Yeah, yeah, well, sure. That's sure. an interesting I mean, one, isn't it? It's quite scary. I just really hope that when Labour start to lose the polls, uh -huh. When people start to turn on Labour, then they've got the opportunity to change the voting system and the, the House of Commons, and hopefully they'll have something similar to what they've got in the Scottish Parliament here. That is the only way that I think that the politics in England can get fairer. Now, if, to me, if I was in the Labour Party, that's what I would be doing. Maybe not straight away, because the party's been out of power for a long time. They want to come in, they want to make and this is slight changes, whatever that's going to be. And then once the right wing media start hounding them, once the people start going back to the Tories, change the vote system. Obviously, people will be against that for the Tories, but for the rest of the, the normal working folk within the England, I would say it gives them a better uh, opportunity to get more involved, and uh, for new parties to emerge, and then negotiations. All these things are so important for politics instead of a between Tory and Tory Labour. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Isn't it very, very weird? 
Yeah. Yeah. Yes, and so, well, Two horses, it would be lovely. Before, you see, sorry, sorry. no, I was just going to say, a politician of the status of Nicola Sturgeon, I mean, how many other people, can you think of any name uh, apart from Alex Salmon that could have stood another nine years on top of the power that went in right at the top with the highest number of votes, the second party of the UK? I mean, it might be quite good for Westminster to have whatever parties in Labour or Tory, it doesn't really uh, matter, as you say, they're kind of just uh, two cheeks of the same face. Uh, yeah. See what I just did there. And, yeah. um, <laughs> you know, two cheeks of the same face. And the SNP is the opposition running Scotland. Mm -hmm. You know, but okay, they need to all. stop the petty stuff, the things yeah. like um, you know, uh, oh, there's so much happening. We haven't time to be looking at independence. All that stuff happening wouldn't be happening if we were independent. Correct. Um, I think a visit this week from Alex Salmon the other day, and he was talking about how the leader comes in, needs to push uh, for all the yes movement to work together. And I think that's something that's been... Uh, you know, hindered over Nicola Sturgeon. Now, don't get me wrong, I, I can understand why she was the way that she was, because if you look at the way, look at the media just now the last couple of days, absolutely hounding all the potential new leaders of the SNP. Mm -hmm. They were never like that when the Tory had the, the PM of the month and they moved on to the next PM. You know, they weren't like that at all. So if, again, it shows the bias that we have with Yeah, media. but yeah, I also think that the mainstream parties, because they are are the parties of power and have a track record of power, I think that the mainstream parties have been infiltrated by a kind of globalist mentality instead of actually saying, this is how we're going to do this. And that's probably a failing of being in the EU, actually. There are very few failings of being in the EU because it gives a seat at the big table. It gave us all these deals. It gave us abundance. It gave us uh, peace, prosperity, food, well-priced food, a decent cost of living, a chance to travel. You could live in Spain or France or Germany. You could live where you liked. You know, wonderful. We were all very much of the same. You'd, uh, how many countries was it together? 52 or something like that, you know? And, uh, and all that tremendous power. I mean, with our dear friends and allies, Germany, we controlled 30% of the whole market. So yeah. it, Britain was still, to an extent, big in the world as a world power. And then we yeah. did this Brexit thing, and now we're just wee timorous beasties shivering in the corner, wondering if we yeah, should, so, uh, yeah, so to, you know? It, it's quite scary because... Uh, people don't see that, you know, we were, had a very big seat at the table in Europe and we were very powerful and influential. That's not the and case. And great for negotiating deals, you see, a fabulous place to negotiate yeah. deals. Yeah, no. If you listen to Michael Heseltine, you remember him. Michael, yes. And he's a lot of it. And he's so rightfully so. You know, it's, it's very rare cases that I keep conservatives, but with... He was, what he was saying, everything was correct, that we're throwing away power, there's so much in-house fighting, we're a laughing stock to the whole world, you know, Labour, uh, we're going to make Brexit work, no, we're not, but you know, the, the, the G7, we're the slowest economy ever, we're going backwards. Oh, we're, we're definitely going backwards. backwards, and I mean, Michael Heseltine's seen the lot, you know, I mean, he was, he, he was a, a, a great politician when he was about... Mm -hmm. Uh, I mean, he was in Thatcher. He resigned from Thatcher's cabinet. I remember the day it happened. And she thought he'd gone out to the loo. <laughs> he just walked yeah. out. She said, has he gone to the loo? Yeah, yeah. And, you know, but I, 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 that's one thing I admire. You know, he stood up. He questioned and he challenged, obviously, back then. You can see the videos. But obviously, just now, still doing that. You see him in the House of Lords debating 
time as well and really getting a right dig in. But don't catch yourself on about Weber. I mean, here's Starmer was up here in Glasgow and, you know, the same goes, tell a lie so many times and it becomes the truth. Well, people up here have to wake up to that because they're trying to spin that over to a uh, S&P popular uh, because of Nicholas Sturgeon and everybody. Well, I would never accuse any politician, politician of, of, I would never accuse any politician of telling a lie I would just say perhaps they're misconstruing the truth. Well, 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 no, I, I think that's a light way, but I think, you know, when people are starving in their houses, Scotty, people are working about their next bill. When there's dodgy dealings going on, which we don't need to go into detail, so Scotland produces more power, up to 10 times what we actually need, but we're having to give it down south to buy it back, most expensive. I'm sorry, I'll call any politician out from down south that's destroyed this country. The last thing before I go as well, yeah, and I said this last night, and we're already starting to get people complaining and moaning, the budget, the, the, the budget that the Scottish government gets is being reduced and reduced. Everything has a knock-on effect, and you're going to feel that with the councils, with the council tax going up, probably about 5%, but I would ask everyone that's got a brain that's listening, that check in about a few weeks' time a uh, uh, Croydon City Council and see what their council tax was up to and then look at your own district council. It's still cheaper than the rest of the UK, but this is an effect that when you reduce the budget, it has a knock-on effect for everything. Absolutely. Some people are saying, just take the money off of something else, that's going to affect something else in Scotland. Absolutely. The only way that we can do better, Scotty, is get independence, get 100% control of our finances, Leave that strong and let's go to the shop, which is a UK. Can't argue with that, Kareem. What a great note to finish on. Dinky do, Thanks, Dorothy. Thank you, Dinky do. There's our Kareem. That, that, what I love about Kareem is his passion. Do you know what I mean? That's what's missing in politics now is the passion. I think Kareem should get into that. Can't understand the thing he'll say he's saying. No, what I think his line was a bit. Uh, echoey, a wee touch under the water there, but nevertheless, an excellent call, uh, and I'm glad that you all heard it. Guys, I think we're going to have to finish up soon. I've just realized I'll try and sort this for you. I'll find out what's doing it, uh, and we'll get that. Fantastic. We can't hear you. And there we go. Very last call. I know you're live in Scottish Funny, and who's that? I think Scottish Big Jim again. Big Jim, how are you? Guys, can we oh, hear hey. Big Jim on the YouTube? I was just, I was just, well, sorry. I'm just asking everybody if we can hear you on the YouTube. Yeah, I think, I think it is, is, uh, you can hear you on YouTube, but you can't hear you on TikTok. All right. I wonder, what's, awesome I, from, I, I wonder what's happened with the TikTok. Let's uh, see. So that's why you've got some people saying they can hear you and some people saying they can't because you can hear you on YouTube, you can't hear you on TikTok. So. And can you hear the caller on YouTube, I wonder? Aye, aye, aye. I can hear the full conversation on YouTube. It's just TikTok, so, you can't hear the caller. Were you able to hear Kareem? Aye, aye, aye. I could hear him born away. And, and you could hear him on the YouTube? I, I, I could hear him. I was born maybe, but I, I could hear him. <laughs> well, I mean, as you're not into politics, I agree with you. It can get a bit dry because well, you hear no, it. But no, the man's no, 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 I mean, Some people don't make sense. I just turn off. But no, uh, no, don't anyway, turn him off because he makes sense. Like, you know. Jim, that's lovely to hear you. And think you do. All the best. Take care. All the best, my boy. There we are. Fantastic. Right, that was it. Can we all hear Big Jim there? He says we can hear fine on the YouTube. So we like that. Tremendous. Right, guys, I'm going to have to dash another great live. Can you all hear me on TikTok now, guys? There we are. Fantastic stuff. Let me know if you can hear the TikTok, please, uh, just before we go. And I'll sing you the goodbye song. How about that? Uh, hey bro, dinky do Big Baz Have a great day, thank you Big Baz You too, love to hear from you uh, If Big Baz is saying Have a great day, I suspect He's on from Australia That's the stuff, is that right Baz? Loud and clear on the TikTok Scotty, thank you Stevie boy, this is wonderful Guys, uh, have a look at all The TikTok videos Get following me as soon as you possibly can 
Uh, hello, Scotty. It's Campbell again. Favourite Scottish war hero. Oh, wow. Well, my father was one. My uncle, who sadly lost his life, was another. Um, I think I'm going to go for Brigadier Lon Campbell VC. Right? He's one of my favorite ones. And another one is I'm going for General Sir Gordon Holmes Alexander Macmillan of Macmillan of Knapp. He's another one of my great war heroes. There we are. We'll take the last call then. Hello, you're live with Scottish phone in. Who's that? Hi, Scotty. It's Christine. Christine. There's no sound. No sound on the YouTube, darling. No. But could you hear me on YouTube? No, nothing. Nothing on the YouTube. Christine, nothing on. stay exactly where you are for a second, darling, till I yeah, get okay. a look at this. I'll put you back on. Yes, put me back on and see how you get on. See if you can hear me. All right. Right. So that should be all right. And I'm just going to check this one and see how we go. How are you keeping? Are you all right? No, Scott, you haven't had a good time recently. Are you having a tough time, my angel? Yes, I've had my cataract done. Ah, well, we send you lots and lots of love. Thank that's, you. That's what I will say to you. We do All lots right. and lots of that. That's very important. And yeah. uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to find out at some point if I can um, get this. Hold on a wee second, darling. Do not dash right. off. Right, that seems to be fine. And that seems to be fine. So I don't know why you can't hear me. I'm going to get to the bottom of it. All right. And I send you lots of love. Thank you, Scotty. Hey, I, Shall I stay on the phone and see if you come through? Uh, no, my darling, I'll find out from the others. Lovely to hear you. All right, take care. Thank you, too, my angel. <laughs> what a super lady. Hello, you're live with Scottish phone in. Who's that? Hello? Nobody. Right. We'll dash off. Guys, we have to go. We're out of time. Oh, my goodness me. And it's been such a fabulous show tonight. I can't thank you all enough. Dinky do. Sorry about the uh, sound on the YouTube. Still not working. Uh, but we will get that sorted at some point. Scotty McLean is saying to every single one of you, thanks for joining us tonight. It's been an absolute blast. And dinky do.